Hello everyone, Zane here and welcome back to my channel. Hope you're all having a great day so far. So in this video I'm going to show you guys how to make gill in Stormblood with Carpenter. Now Carpenter in my eyes doesn't have too many things that I find worthy of selling for gill, so this list will be very short. As a disclaimer, always make sure you check your market board on your server, because each server prices will be different. I'm on Gilgamesh, so anybody who's watching this video on Craig will have a little easier time. Alright, so the first thing on this list is going to be Beach Lumber. Now, Beach Lumber has two alternate uses, Lev Quests and Scripts. Okay. Beach Lumber is mostly the preferred wood that people like to spam for Love Quest to level up their Carpenter. Alright, so as you can see here, people have undercutted poorly yet again. Not surprising. So, ranging from 600 to possibly 5,000. And you can see my sales history here, high quality and normal quality have seemed to be selling quite well. Now, as always, if you're selling, doing love quests, you of course want to get high quality because you get double the experience. But if you're just using them for crafting, either or will do just fine. So again, make sure you look see what sells more, high quality or normal quality and judge by there. Beach lumber is also used in making the copper nickel books for alchemists, for those of you who want to do script farming for alchemists. Next is going to be pine lumber. Now, the same thing with beach lumber is a left quest for pine, and also they're used in scripts as well. Pine lumber is a little bit more expensive, as you can see, ranging from about say 2,200. I'm going to cut the point off at about 6,000. All right, as you can see here, they've been selling great for the past two days. Uh, seems to be normal quality over high quality, but again, go by your judgment and of course by your marker board history. Pine lumber is used, and I believe in. Tiger Skin Grimoires and Codexes. Perfect for alchemists who are trying to do script farming as well. That's the one thing each wood has in common, that they're used in the books for alchemists. This makes them very useful. Next is the Persimmon. Now this one doesn't have a love, love quest attached to it, so again, they're still used for making uh, alchemy books for scripts. And these are going to be the mirrored leather books that these are used for. So again, people horribly undercutted. Seems, seems to be the same person. I know this person to be a known crappy undercutter. So we're going to skip these and go straight from the 2000. And we'll probably cut the point off at 18,000. Even though I doubt people are going to buy them for that. So as you can see in his sales history, it's not as great as the other ones, but again, they're very useful because mirrored grimoire books are most likely to pop up on your script menu for Alchemist. So these should be really more expensive than this. But Persimmon is definitely one of my favorites that I farmed a lot when I was doing red script farming. Next is the Zokova Lumber. Now these also have a lev attached to it and also used for yellow script farming for alchemist since the gazelle skin books need Zakova lumber. And of course you're also making the Zakova accessories which I've already made a video of why using Zakova is a lot cheaper than actually making the black willow accessories. 30 hits on my server ranging from 1900 all the way up to 12,000. But it seems to be around 5,000 seems to be the dominant one. 
High quality seems to be more diamond over normal quality, and they've been selling pretty decently the past couple of days. And now for the end game crafting is the Uriande. As you know, these are used for end game carpenter stuff. So, normal quality from 20,000 into high quality around 50,000. Of course, some, looks like somebody bought off all the cheap ones. But as you can see, you want to sell high quality over normal quality, of course, because people will pay for them. And they've been selling great for the past uh, three days. And for my honorable mention, Black Willow Lumber. Black Willow Lumber is actually used to make the Black Willow Accessories, which is the highest crafted accessory that you guys can make. So, 17 hits on my server, ranging from 20,000 all the way up to possibly 30,000. I'm not going to go any higher than that. So, as you see, high quality is dominant over normal quality, of course. Because of the better use for with Sokovia accessories as you can see here they haven't really been selling too great but again that's and that's why it's called an honorable mention maybe you guys sell these a little bit better on yours but on mine they're pretty much not really selling too well so guys that is pretty much gonna be it for a carpenter like I said this is gonna be a very short video since there's not too many things that I do find notable for selling Alright guys, so that's pretty much going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like if you found this useful. Any comments, questions, and or concerns, as always, put them in the comment section down below. I'll be more than happy to help you guys out with any questions you might have. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new for more Final Fantasy XIV Stormblood content. And as a reminder, make sure you hit that notification bell next to my subscribe button. This way you guys will never miss an upload. So until next time, guys, may you forever walk in the glorious light of Lord Bahamut. Take care guys, and happy selling as always.